You remind me of Lydia from Beetlejuice, lol. Yes, she gives me total Winona Ryder vibes, love it. You even sound like Winona, kind of. Very cool. I was just about to comment that you remind me of Winona Ryder. That's what I thought, LMAO, the voice and everything. You remind me of Winona Ryder when she was young. You are beautiful. You look like Kat Dennings. I'm sure you get that a lot. First thing I thought too, lol, and yes. Oh, hi, Kat Dennings. Everybody, welcome back to my channel or to my channel if you are new. Today's video is very, very exciting because it's actually inspired by some of you guys' comments. On one of my most viewed videos, which is my Billy Razor video, I have almost like 20,000 views, which is crazy to think about, but some of the comments are very similar to each other and a few other videos have these comments too, but they are that I look like either Winona Ryder or Kat Dennings. These comments were very interesting to me, especially because one other time at a restaurant someone told me I looked like Winona Ryder and for other people to say it too, I'm like, do I? And there are some kind of similarities I can see with both Winona and Kat. I don't think my whole face really looks like either of them. My nose kind of like bumps up in the middle. I think Kat's does that. My eyebrow shape is similar to Winona's and a, and a few little things, but I really wanted to test this out and make this into a video of me transforming into the people you said I look like. Especially because my Billy Razor video, which has most of those comments, was done like a while ago. So I think I changed a little bit in appearance, but I want to test it out. So let's get started and see how much I can look like both of them. <laughs> I'm first gonna start out trying to recreate some pictures of Winona. So I don't know if I'm gonna do both of these, but I found this one and also this one. And I'm not sure which one I'll be able to do better, but I am going to try them both. I have outfits for both. After I take the pictures, I'm probably going to try to edit them a little bit so I can really try to make them look as similar as possible. So in these pictures, she has very similar makeup, very minimal. I mean, I don't know like face wise, but the eyes, it doesn't look like there's much going on there. Um, but the lips, the lips are what stands out the most to me. So I need to get a red lip on. I shall go look and see my choices. I found this red lipstick. I have a gloss because it looks like her lips are shiny. So I'm gonna put this on top and then I just have a lip liner. I'm gonna try this picture first. She looks a lot more pale than I do. I'll probably have to edit that a little bit. But her hair, I didn't look at the picture close enough and I thought her hair was just curled. So that's why I got my hair curled, but it's actually like flipping up like this. So that's not gonna be the same, but oh well, I'll do my best for the rest. Let's get this lip on here. So kind of got a basic shape going on. Now time for this. I, I think this is just like from the Dollar Tree, but it's one of the brightest red lipsticks I have. I kind of wish I wore red lipstick more cause like, kind of like it. Oh, this looks like kind of purpley. Hopefully it'll be okay. Maybe, you know, maybe that's exactly what I needed though. That looks really similar. The outfit I'm gonna be wearing for this video is this like jumpsuit I have because the top is very similar to the top of, I think she's in a dress, but they're very similar. So this is what I'm gonna be wearing. I got, <laughs> I got a black towel draped over the door because her background is just very dark and I don't know if I'm going to paste myself in her background or what. So I just thought to be safe, we got a towel and my phone's here. I can't like do her mouth. <laughs> She has, I think, a, a, I have a longer face than her. It's weird because you, when you really like start to compare and break down somebody that is your lookalike, you're like. Okay, I'm gonna take the next picture now. I really feel like I just, I'm just not seeing the similarities anymore. <laughs> Here is the next picture and she again has the same red lip on so I'm keeping that. I need to pull the top half of my hair back and then for the outfit I am going to combine a leotard I have and a cardigan to kind of get a similar, similar look. 
Okay, here is the outfit. Gonna kind of fold these in because hers like has a solid line because hers is like an actual top or a dress. Minor two pieces combined together, but I'm making it work. I still am just like seeing less and less resemblance the more I am trying to recreate these pictures. I'm gonna take this picture and then move on to the Kat Denny's outfit change. Then I'll edit the photos at the end and show you guys. These two photos are the photos that I'm going to try to recreate for Kat. And I think her face shape is going to be a little bit easier because I think when Nona's face shape is shorter, like she just has a shorter face, but Kat has a longer face like I do. So hopefully I can find more similarity maybe, I don't know. The first photo of Kat's I'm gonna do is this one. And I have a shirt that is cut off like that, but it's maroon. <laughs> so I'm just gonna still wear this for the shape of it. Also, I don't have long luscious locks. I think I'm gonna try to curl a little bit more since I kind of like brushed it out. Otherwise, she has a red lip on too. I am just gonna kind of pat off the gloss and make it more matte. And then I'm gonna try this picture. I really wish I had my dark hair right now because this would just be a lot better, but it's fine. Me editing this after I dyed my hair. Time for pictures. I think I got the picture that's gonna be the most similar. Here's the next picture. I have a jacket that has like maroon on it. Not on the sleeves though, but it's it's whatever. Um, I thought about trying to get my cat in it, but I have a feeling she's not gonna cooperate. So yeah, I don't know. We'll see about that. <laughs> wow, I just realized that this jacket is from the Pretty Little Liars line from Aeropostale when they had that. This jacket is old, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, that's probably not gonna happen, is it? I could hold you like this, but she's not holding the kitty like this. She's She doesn't really like being picked up that much, but she's okay sometimes. You wanna go down? Okay, I guess you won't be my special guest in my picture. It's fine. <laughs> Photos are taken to my best ability by myself. So I am going to probably put these in some type of editing software and try to edit it so where they look more similar. I could see more of like if Kat Dennings and Winona like had a baby. <laughs> If, if their jeans went together, I feel like it would create something that looks like me maybe, but individually, I don't know. Let's see where editing takes us. <laughs> All right guys, so I just finished editing the pictures and I'm not sure what I think about them, but you you be the judge. <laughs> Here's the first Winona picture. Um, and I think I'm gonna show you kind of the process <laughs> of like what I got up to. So this was the picture of me before anything. And then we have the picture of me, I think I like, darkened my hair, I lightened my skin a little because she was a little more pale than me, and maybe darkened the eyebrows a tad. And then we have <laughs> just me putting myself in the background. Here are the two photos side by side. I kind of messed with the saturation to try to make it even lighter. My skin was still just like too yellow tinted, but this was the best I could do. Our face shapes are definitely not similar. My eyebrows arch a little bit more, but I don't know, what do you guys think? Now here is the second Winona picture. And here's what my picture looked like from the very beginning. Then I did a little little bit of quick editing to it um, and darkened my hair. I think I darkened the lips a little and my eyebrows, oh, skin lighter skin tone. And then I put myself in the background. These just crack me up because I I tried to do these so fast. So I literally just like cut out myself and then I just put it in the background, not really worrying much about pieces of her in the background. <laughs> but anyways, here are the two pictures. What do you think? I feel like if if my face was a little less long, I would look more similar like her. And my eyebrows are just a little thicker than hers, maybe. I don't know, there's definitely multiple differences, but how did I do? Was I pretty close? Did I do the best I could? Yes. <laughs> 
Now on to Kat. Honestly, I thought this first photo was gonna be easier to recreate, but the lighting in it is so different because <laughs> it's like outside, I'm guessing. And mine is just with direct light. So it definitely, the lighting looks different. <laughs> but anyways, here is my original picture. Here is my one where I edited some things darker shirt, darker hair, and then this is me inserted in the picture with a little bit of her shoulders showing. And here is both of them together. I think my face shape is more similar and her eyes are pretty big like mine. Our noses are kind of similar, spot on, like forward. But man, that lighting like almost ruins it. I don't know, I'm just like, I keep looking at it, I'm like, <laughs> the last one, the lighting is weird too, but I think this is the picture that looks most similar to one of them. So this is the cat photo <laughs> with the cat. And here is my original photo. Then we got the one edited, darker hair, a little darker lips because I went a little too bright. And I think I lightened my skin a little bit. And then here, I put myself in the picture. <laughs> and here is both of them beside each other. Yeah, this one's probably my favorite one. I see more similarities in the picture than the other ones. That is everything. Um, I, again, I don't really think that I look like them completely. I think it's more like if you mix them together, it would maybe create me. And this was still really fun to do, especially because it was inspired by all your guys' comments. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think. If you thought I looked like either of them before, do you still? Or do you now think I look a little bit like both of them combined? I don't know. Just let me know. Also, I wanna do a Q&A at some point, maybe this year or when I hit 1K. So if you guys would like to send some questions down below in the comments, I'll just you know keep track of all these questions, build them up and eventually, hopefully, be able to answer them. Subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up. Also hit that bell notification because I never say that, but then you can be reminded that I have a new video. <laughs> Follow my social media accounts there at the beginning of this video or in the description box below. I hope you guys have an amazing day or night, whatever it is where you are right now, and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.